But first, let's take a look at the here and now of Northwest Ohio. We're headed to Heart Gallery and Studio for an interactive exhibit. Heart Gallery and the mission of St. Paul's Lutheran Church is a small hidden gem in downtown Toledo. They made the decision to turn some unused rooms in their building for community engagement. So one way to do that is through art. This month is an exhibit uh, produced by Sacred Threads. So the idea behind Sacred Threads was an opportunity for women to express their emotional journey. Woven Together is another project that we have at, at Heart Gallery. We have three large looms that are on wheels. The intention was that they would go outside of the church and while people are milling and waiting around, we're offering them an opportunity to weave and just share a little bit about how we are connected together in Toledo. We were excited to be a part of it. It was an opportunity for us to donate some shirts and also utilize them in a really fun way. Having the loom in our space, it's something that really stands out. Everybody that walks in sees it. And so visually, it's a really nice piece to have in our store. It's a lot of fun to have something that's interactive, to see people that are using it, to enjoy it. I think it makes people think of the different opportunities that people have to create art in their daily lives. The idea is that the looms can move around the Toledo area. As the pieces grow, then we'll take them off the loom. Then we have a story uh, of the people, where it was woven, and maybe some stories of the people that contributed to the weaving. It seems like a particularly good time in our history of our city and our country to be acknowledging that we are so diverse yet so woven together. Celebrating Tiger Bakery's 50th anniversary. It's just an amazing feeling. And actually, to be honest with you, it hasn't really hit us yet. 50 years is it's a really big thing. It really allows us to realize of how, you know, amazing the Toledo community is. Tiger Bakery offers uh, many amazing products from the Middle Eastern uh, region. So whenever a customer comes in, we make sure that you're coming out of our place with a smile, um, whether that's from the food or whether from that's from us. Everybody here is a family, so when you come in here, we treat you like a family. All our products are made with love. When we started in January of 2021, we partnered up with uh, Odd Fodder. We used our delicious homemade sweets, our chocolate baklava and almond baklava. The owner took that and made it into a shake. For February, we are partnering up with Berry Bagels. We're taking their everything bagel seasoning and putting it in our hummus. We are always looking for fun, creative things to do with food, um, especially when it takes taking different cultures or different flavors and putting them all together. And so we got a call out of the blue from Kareem from Tiger Bakery, and he said, hey, we're just gonna be our 50 years. We wanna do this milkshake, and we thought of you guys. And I thought it was like the coolest thing ever. You know what, it's just awesome because they're a staple in this town. They've been here for 50 years and we're fairly new to the game here. So we, it, was, it was really an honor to be asked to, to participate in this. Tiger Bakery is one of the most iconic and important small businesses in our city, but they're also uh, community minded. So the fact that they would reach out you know, to whomever, Barry's Bagels or whoever else, uh, this is really a win-win. Uh, everything, everything about Tiger Bakery is good. Revving our engines for Jeep Fest 2021. You know, with, with the cancellation last year, there were a lot of people who were very disappointed. So this year, we have been met with anticipation, the excitement uh, beyond belief. Uh, we've got vendors calling us saying, hey, we want to participate. We wanted to come last year, we couldn't do it. This year we want to be there. So we're excited. I think there's a, a pent up excitement from uh, our, our, our group. Our, clearly our sponsors and vendors are excited. And I think we're looking forward to a good year. Cleo has showed they like a good celebration around their hometown product Jeep. 80 years of Jeep, this, is a, this will be a celebration that will be locally driven. Sure, we're looking for people to come in from other places. But this is our party too. 
Um, we, we built the thing. Um, generations of people. I'm a retiree. I have people who retired before me and people that are still working in the plant all have, are bound by one family. And the community will be out doing that, I think, in August in force. Checking in with Sports Nightly. And let's take a look at our BK Player of the Week. Crawford had some very impressive numbers last week. She's on our top 30 BCSN list, by the way. She dropped 31 points in Central's overtime loss against Toledo Christian, 22 coming in the first half. And then the very next day, she followed it up with 21 points in their victory over the Springfield Blue Devils. A combined 52 points in just two games. Not a bad outing for the senior captain. Crawford says even though she was one of the the one with the hot hand last week, she couldn't have done it without her teammates. Um, well, just kind of in warm-ups, like getting focused and really just focusing on my shot, um, doing all the right things, game speed, everything, it all kind of plays into my game. And then once I hit a few, like in the game, I just kind of, you know, get confident with it. And then, um, you know, just with my teammates and stuff, you know, off the court and stuff cheering me on, it really helps as well. I mean, everyone really plays a big part in it. Um, you know, just coming up the floor, pushing the ball up the floor. Um, coach trusted me a lot, so that's really nice and that helps. Um, you know, all my players, you know, they also trusted me and, you know, I, you know, I, I know, you know, what my role is and having to play that role, so I'm just doing everything for the team. Now that you know what's happening in Toledo, here's what's happening near you. Enjoy the tastes and sounds of New Orleans without leaving Toledo at the Mardi Gras Chef Table Dinner Series. Get a breathtaking view at the Toledo Zoo's rare and exotic orchid show. And celebrate the 10th annual Project PJ by donating bedtime comforts to the Seagate Food Bank. Stay tuned, there's more Bcan Pulse headed your way after this short break.